Hey everyone, it's Nancy with She's Got Yarn. How's everybody doing? Um, happy Tuesday. It's Tuesday afternoon. I've already done this video once, trying to do it on my PC. My PC, it looks like um, I might have some bugs or something. But anyways, I had to get my IT guy to come and check it out. Um, I just wanted to hop on here to remind you guys, tonight is our 8 o'clock live with Lynette and Nancy over at my channel tonight and um we've got a bunch of exciting stuff coming up we've got um the new make along we've um kind of got it together um now so we've got more information for you and another thing i want to talk about this is just a real quick update um i reached out yesterday uh i i don't know some of you may know some of you may not know but i worked in oncology for um like 28 years um, I think I was like 22 years old and I retired it. I don't know. Was it in 2013 or 14 from oncology? I think it was 13. But anyways, um, the healthcare system changed, but, um, it doesn't mean that I didn't care about the people I worked with. Well, anyways, I worked for two amazing, worked with two amazing physicians. They, one's a medical oncologist and the other one is a radiation oncologist. But anyways, yesterday... Well, this month being breast cancer awareness, I was like, I wonder if their phone numbers still work, you know, and I wonder if they come up and talk about breast cancer awareness and, on, on my channel. And um, they said they would do it. They would be, it was their pleasure to do it. So I've got two um, physicians and possibly their nurse. I want to uh, reach out to their nurse. Her name's Alice. It's uh Anyways, I'm not going to give any names because, you know, people start looking it up. I want it to be a surprise. I want you guys to have fun with it. Um, I mean, it's a serious thing. I mean, um, both of them used to run free clinics um, and people would come in and they would find lumps and bumps, you know, and, you know, some people, they don't have insurance, so they, they ignore things and they think that they can't get treated, but nobody gets turned away. There are programs for everybody out there, okay? You just... You need to go get checked out. Get your mammogram. Um, if you feel something, they're, they're going to help you. Okay? So, I, I'm from Ga the Gainesville area. The physicians worked in Gainesville. I worked in Gainesville at their practice. It was a cancer center. And, um, yeah, we treated a lot of people that didn't have insurance. So, um, yeah, that's why they have Shands, University of Florida. You can get treated there. You know, and they've got, if you're really sick, that's where you need to be, you know. But anyways, these ladies um, agreed to come up on the channel and answer some questions. So what I want you guys to do is get your questions together um, so that I can ask the questions and they can answer them. Okay. Um, I may not get them all answered, but I certainly try. Okay. But um, I'm really excited and I'm excited to see them. Um, I've ran into, well, one of them treated my dad for cancer, and he's still here. And um, the other one, um, she takes care of my daughter. <laughs> so Tiffany has a blood disorder. A lot of you know that. Um, it's no secret. But anyways, they've been very good to my family. I loved working with them both. One of them crochets, and her daughter crochets, so that's kind of cool. And I kind of shared with her what I was doing with Boggy Creek and, and then also October being the um, Breast Cancer Awareness Month. And they were just so, they were happy to do it. So they're going to do it on a Tuesday, the 24th. That's what we've tentatively to have scheduled unless something happens. But they sounded excited. So get ready. I'm so excited. So tonight, um, my channel, 8 o'clock with Charm Grammy, and you guys, um, it's 2.30 right now, or quarter to 3, but anyways, so you guys go over there tonight, spread the word that we're going to have some oncologists um, up on uh, our channel and um, as guests, and hopefully we can get some questions asked and get as many women on the same page that they need to get their mammograms um, and how important it is. And it saves lives. Early detection saves lives. Um, I'm a I'm a witness to it. Okay, for 28 years. So, but anyways, all right, guys. That's all I have right now. Um, I might put a video together. Well, you're gonna see me tonight. <laughs> yeah. 
So yeah, I'll see you guys tonight. All right. I love you all. Eight o'clock Eastern Standard Time. My channel. She's got yarn too. Bye.